hello. Hello, hello, hello. How are we all doing today? I can confirm, by the way, that my Xbox controller is in fact dead. Um, and YouTube hasn't paid me this month yet. So, uh, <laughs> found that out when I went to uh, buy the Xbox One controller last night. <laughs> Your card has been declined. You have no money. Oh, okay then. How are we all doing today? Did I get the money you sent me? Probably? <laughs> if it's ended by a super chat, no. Um, YouTube's uh, a bit slow on paying, paying up this month, apparently. Bradley, hello, and Sean as well. And Sam. Alexander Lewis and SRF, of course. You sent it through PayPal. Patreon. Yes, Patreon paid out, I think. Um, although Patreon pays out at weird times. Hey Austin, and JM Aerial Photography. I think Patreon pays out at the end of the month. YouTube usually pays around the 15th. No sign of that yet. Eddie. You're following me on Instagram. I need to, I need to actually use Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> I'm terrible at it. I was looking at my Instagram the other day, there's like nothing new up there. So I will start uh, putting pictures and stuff up on Instagram uh, eventually. Soon. I promise. Um, Irish farmer though. Hello, Dal. So what can be regarded as a general annoyance, we're using the Culti Plow and the Quad Track to do some headlands because the trees annoy the hired workers, apparently. Hey Jeremy, hope I'm well. I'm reasonably well. <laughs> I'd have been a lot better if I'd remembered to do a thumbnail before like a minute to five. Um, <laughs> which is why I started slightly late. Um, if ever I start ever so slightly late, it's because I was I'd forgotten to do a thumbnail, um, and uh, I was sorting it out at five o'clock. Little tips and tricks for knowing what I, what I'm doing. <laughs> why why I'm a couple of minutes late and there's a new thumbnail. Have my legs recovered? No, they're still they're not as bad as they were yesterday, so I can use the wheel, but um, they're still a bit stiff. It's mainly my calves now. Yesterday it was like my entire legs were just like, no, no, why do this? I must forget them as well. Yes, I try and do them just before streams, so it ends up with me um, rushing to get a thumbnail done at like a minute to five. I don't know if Simulate's streaming today, by the way, guys. Um, I meant to ask him last night, but he was too busy playing uh, No Man's Sky. Hey, CD. I saw the pictures you sent me uh, last night as well. They look good. And again... Didn't, I haven't had a chance to reply. Well, I did have a chance to reply, I just didn't. Um, I've not been on my PC long. <laughs> and uh, there's a lot I want to try and get done today. I didn't get any recording done today like I said I would because I slept for like 12 hours last night and didn't get up until uh, about 1 o'clock. Or thereabouts. Um, so I didn't do basically anything today other than sleep, which. I apparently needed to do. Um, so I'm going to do some uh, script work on rewriting the Cattle and Crops script. Chris's stream was jokes last night. I wasn't there. <laughs> I was falling asleep on TeamSpeak instead. I don't know why I've decided to do this from the rear view, but I'm doing this from the rear view like this. Maybe it's a bit more dramatic, I don't know. Unbelievably, you say unbelievably, it's completely believable that the animation method has changed. I think the better word is frustratingly, the 17 animations wouldn't work. 
I think Giants changed a few things around in GE and, and how things work just to um, frustrate people who wanted to do really quick bad conversions to prevent them from doing really quick bad conversions and to encourage people um, to actually put effort in. <laughs> Unfortunately the people who put, who put in effort in regardless have to put in a bit more effort than usual because things have changed and things break. Like Adeline Crops. It's a script talking about Adeline Crops Thomas. I swear I've talked about this yesterday with you. Is leg like, still sore? Fine. How can I get comments for your channel while you're streaming on your phone? Uh, navigate your way to the dashboard in your phone's browser. That's the, the way that I did it with my phone. Um, however, now I've got a... Like, I never really needed to do that, though, because I had a second screen. If, if you're trying to stream, I always recommend you have two, two screens minimum. Any new mods? Not that I could see today, Bradley, but there might have been some put up in the hour or so since I checked. Always take that with a grain of salt when I, or with a pinch of salt when I say, oh, there's no, no new mods because they might have been put up while I wasn't looking. Giants like doing that. They like sneaking things up behind me back and just going like, boo, mods. Yeah, oh, thanks. Thanks for that. They do the same to Landy. And Sim. I think there was a video, Sim recorded, I think, a Riverview video saying, Oh, I really want to use the TC590, but it's not out yet. Literally, when he'd finished recording, he went into speak and said, Hey, Sim, did you see the TC590's out? You are! <laughs> Let's get this on Hard Worker. Actually, no new mods. Good. I haven't been uh, kerfluffled by giants today. Um... I'm gonna have to do this field manually, I think. Looked about half an hour ago. Yeah, I looked about an hour ago and there was nothing, so. Hello, Nathan, by the way. Yanis. Well, was a good idea to just check instead of asking. 204 in the queue. Oh god, that's getting worse. Hey, Ernie. How's it going? It's gone relatively good. I woke, I woke up at like six o'clock this morning and just went no, 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 no. This is no, this is too early. I'm going back to sleep, and then I woke up again about noon. I was like, oh crap. <sighs> got six hours sleep, went back to sleep, and got another six hours sleep. That was that was a bad idea, as it turns out. What do I think of the show all mods stop mods thing? I only check the website, so I don't see the show all mods stop mods thing. That was my Monday. Uh, very lazy. Been having a lazy Monday. I've played Dirt Rally... Dirt Rally 1? Yes. Dirt Rally 2, I've not even seen, seen previews of that. Hello, Yuzo. I think Jimmy Broadbent's supposed to be doing a preview. Apparently, but I don't know yet. Don't think he knows yet. Speaking of previews, I do have a game that I would like to preview for you guys. Um, and it's going to be two videos. And I'm after deci I decided this uh, the other day and I've just not got around to recording it. Hopefully I'll get up early tomorrow and um, I'll get at least one of them recorded. Uh, one video is going to be me actually being serious, one's going to be me being me. Hey, Faisy. Do you keep, like, remaking your YouTube account or something? Because I, every few days I get a new email through, Faisy, look, I subscribed to you on YouTube. What the hell? <laughs> Do you, like, keep making new accounts? Hey, 
Hey, dude. How you doing today, dude? Thought you thought you were calling me Squirrel there for a second. Can't wait for Metagross to come out. I, I will say, Jack, I know you've probably watched a couple of the um, first looks. I don't have a first look. I don't plan on making a first look. Um, when the map is ready to come out, I will start up on it. Um, I, oh, Nathan put up a new version last night. I've not checked that out yet. Um, I'll be on it. Trust me. That's a map that I'll play. Um, also, if you haven't seen the community post that I put up today, because I'm, I'm, I'm doing you a bit of shilling real quick. If you didn't see the community post, the server has been renewed. Got it renewed yesterday during the stream. That's why I was... New version again. again. Okay. <laughs> um, I was talking to Nitrata yesterday during the stream. Um, no time off, yo. And uh, the server has been renewed. It is back up as per normal. The joy is testing, yeah. That's why I don't want to do content on I don't want to do content on a map that like is gonna change every couple of days or every day or multiple times a day. Like I want it to be stable and kind of a finished version first. Um and ideally bug free. <laughs> um But I, I want to put a different map on the server and I can't figure out which one. It's right now it's between this and Riverview to go up. Such a perfect map. Yeah, it really is, Jack. It's nice for... I, it's, like, perfect for the style that I play. Because I tend to play... Quite small. Helper Eye is blocked by an object. He's found a tree, no doubt. Farming Man, hello. And Adam as well, hello, hello, hello. Almost missed you there, Adam. I apologize. But Meadow, Meadow Grove just suits the way that I play. A map that I cannot really pronounce in Europe. What, Felsbrunn? What map are you talking about? We're talking about Meadow Grove and like... I guess just maps in general right now, because I want to put a new map on the server. There's a community post. Please put replies on that because... Um, I'll vet whatever maps you guys suggest, and then probably like tomorrow or Wednesday-ish I'll put up a poll um, of what map you guys want on the server and we'll go from there. Um, I'll sort out the server Friday night and probably uh, grab Carturix and be like, Carturix, you're always on the server, give me help. Help me, I need to put a new map on and I want to set it up and it takes like an hour to set it up so I don't want to do it solo. Oh, Thiering or Oberland? Um, that is... The thing with that map, Thiering or Oberland, is it's not on any sites that I really trust. Um, I've got nothing against it, I've got everything against the sites that it's on, unfortunately. Metagrove 19 only is slightly different. Um, it feels slightly different, but it, like... Especially the main yard, but once you get out of the main yard, it is pretty much the same. I think Nathan's really, uh, really nailed the cow yard this time. That does not need changing, Nathan. I know that you're tempted, but no. Nathan's got a thing with changing yards. So we'll have to go over to the cult to plow and get that fixed up in a second. I might just turn off force plowing on this map. <laughs> So for those of you who don't, who don't know what my rules for mods are this time, I'm being ultra picky. You actually like the arts? Oh, thank goodness, Nathan. That's a first. Um, basically, I'm not going to play as much as possible. Um, I know there's going to be scripts that'll be elsewhere. Uh, NIF, no. That, that's just a hard no because it's nothing against the map itself. 
everything against the people who decided to come in when I voiced some concerns about Air Ireland and decided to start attacking me. So, no, I'm not playing that because people are idiots. Um, and I don't want those people around my channel harassing me and causing problems, so... Not touching that map um, as a direct result of the community has managed to uh, get around it, unfortunately. Nothing against the makers, nothing against any who does play it, but I don't. I don't want to play a map that's only going to succeed in bringing drama and crap to the channel. Don't want that at all. Upload is very sketchy, Bob. You are correct to be concerned about that. Aaron has grown on you. I've got nothing against it, but with Meadow Grove coming and with Marwell coming, um, not only is there probably not really space for a third map <laughs> on the channel, but I like I, get, I just don't want to have the hassle of the people that are going to attack me for playing it wrong in their eyes or you know, attack me for criticizing it for one reason or another. Um, when I don't really straight up attack maps anymore. I used to, but I don't anymore. It's the Facebook group. It's always the Facebook group bringing drama, Ethan. It's always Facebook. If there's drama, it's Facebook. There's something, there's something about Facebook that just causes drama. Can't wait for Meadow Grove. Meadow Grove is really good. I haven't had a play on it yet. I just kind of had to run around looking at the starter equipment. Nathan, you've absolutely nailed the starter equipment. Um, the only and this is going to be this is going to sound weird because I'm going to criticize and praise all at once here. The only thing that I, I don't like about the starter equipment is there's no fertilizer um, equipment whatsoever, which is great in a way because. The fertilizing equipment that it really fit on Metagrove is the um, the small Amazon spreader from the Mod Hub, um, especially for like lime, because the big trailed one is nonsensically huge for maps like that. Um, so it, it, it's it's great that the option is there from the outset to have just the Amazon because it makes the most sense as a so, number one a pellet spreader number two a lime spreader um, although I would say like a sprayer would be nice yeah I mean the only sprayer that I'd really say would make sense um, would be like the Coon Deltas or the Hardy Mega and even they're maybe a bit big the, the in-game fertilizer spreader is huge Especially like for lime, because like this is the smallest option for lime, and it's it's massive. You wouldn't have that on a farm that size. Even this, you wouldn't have. I've got nothing against Facebook. Obviously, I've got the, the Facebook page for the channel. It's just that I, there's something about the community pages on Facebook, <laughs> farms and community. That it's just drama and nonsense all the time, and like. Sure, I go on it to watch the drama and nonsense sometimes, but I don't want to hear. Um, a weeder would be nice, yeah. Can the one I'm up do lime? The little Amazon I'm up can do lime. It is absolutely my go-to um, small fertilizer spreader. It was 100% my absolute go-to because it's it's just. Like, it's small, it's tiny, and it, it fits so many maps so well. Hey, Farm Life. If I could base a map, where would it be and why? Uh, it'd be in Ireland, because I'm in Ireland. There's not enough really top-notch Irish maps. The only one from 17, really, was 
Shamrock Valley and that got overlooked and, and swamped by the time that it came out and it sucks that that happened, but it did. Um, so I'd probably make an Irish map. I was making one for a period, uh, but I gave up on the idea mainly because uh, just time constraints were there, I just don't have the time to be making a map. Pretty happy yourself, you don't want to change any of the arts. Yeah, you've, you've done well with the starter come the only thing is probably like... Because like... I'd say maybe add a leader. But like, that's maybe it. It does suck that there's not a smaller um, forage wagon as well. Because the one that you start with on Meadow Grove is a bit big, but that's the smallest in-game one. Why don't I make other mods? Because I don't have the time to do those either. Making a mod is a commitment of hundreds if not thousands of hours that I don't have. Hell as it stands, I'm struggling to make the time to work on scripts for this channel. More than happy to test mods from people that I know make good mods, so... Or, or have the cap are, are capable of making good mods at the very least, so... Nathan, Dusty, Matt, Oxy. A round baler... That'd be kind of cool, actually. That'd be different. So how much did the... Oh my god, it only did one pass and got confused, didn't it? Where did it... Where... Where did the quad track go? Oh, you got confused but Yeah, I understand how that happened now. What just happened there? Yeah, dude. You've been ba Austin, you've been banned now. Hope you're pleased with yourself. Don't don't advertise yourself like that in somebody else's stream. That's horrifically disrespectful. Right. There's a case. Where did I put the Where did I put the Lime spreader? Because I need that. Hey DMF and see you Bradley. There it is. Is it I swear that had lime in it before. Oh, you meant by that dude, okay. How long do bands last? I got to unban you, didn't I? Mm. Uh, gonna do what I said I wouldn't do yesterday. So just bear with once I get down to the field here. I know Laura who sings. No. It's pink and green Valter, that's on Riverview. Actually, that's not on Riverview, it's gone. Uh, so let me just... I forgot to unban Farmer Campion. Uh, community settings. I'm doing it now, it's just awkward to uh, navigate my way through to it. There we go. You, you should be unbanned on your other account now. YouTube is awkward to navigate in general, but if you're going to the um, through the Creator Studio, it's 
just, oh my god. It was designed by a monkey who had no idea what humans wanted, I swear. Right, that'll be enough for now, because I just need to go and fix up the bit of this field that I missed. Which may be getting plowed currently. In fact, is getting plowed currently. That's helpful. That's really helpful. I hope it's not plowing like straight through the other end where I'm going to need to see it. It's not. That's good. Why aren't there any seed refill bonds or fertilizer? There's only seed uh, lime one. There are other ones as well. Uh, could you just try commenting on your other account, dude? Just to make sure that it is actually unbanned, because sometimes it says that you're unbanned, but it, you're not. Because YouTube is dumb like that. YouTube's great for doing that. Like, yeah, you've done a thing, uh, but we're not actually gonna, you know... We're not, we're not gonna actually do the thing, we're gonna tell you you've done it, so that you feel good about yourself. Don't let it be said that I don't give se people um, second chances. I try my best to give people like as many chances as I... I'm willing to, but some people just... Jump way beyond our... like, straight away. So many good maps on their way. Metagirl, Marwell Manor, Peterville, Perbeck Valley! Uh, Perbeck Frasa is... I think on hold? Tom was in um, Landy stream the other day saying he's back to work now until basically in November. Um, so I think Perbeck might have been put on hold by him. And I hope if it's not finished that it, and he doesn't have the time to work on it, that it is just put on hold and it's not just cancelled or rushed. I'd like to see him put kind of the effort that the map deserves into the map. I always, I always like seeing mappers and modders put the effort that mods deserve into them. Um, Peterville I've not checked out yet. And I don't want to check out until it's ready. Uh, Meadowgrove I've checked out, that is really good. Marwell, I've not even watched Landy's first look on it. I'm one of these people who just does not want to watch pre-release content on maps. Um, Peterville looks awesome. Again, uh, I don't want to watch content on it. I, it's just... It's just a thing that I've always done. Like, I don't watch pre-release content on maps because... I want to... kind of have that discovery period by myself and not have somebody else walk me through. Hey, well. I have to come to console, you watch the previous content for mostly in PC. Uh, Marwell's most likely console. Uh, well, Marwell's come to console almost 100%. Uh, Meadowview. Meadow, I forgot the name of the map already. Nathan's one. I think he's probably going to try. He should. Um, <laughs> he's more than capable. Just takes a bit of time. Try to come. Oh, for the love of God, YouTube. Um, Nathan's more than capable of getting his map onto console. It's just whether he can basically be bothered putting the time in is is the issue. Because uh, it does take a lot of time. Or can take a lot of time. Meadow Grove. Um, Yanis, I have no idea. It's 1000 dependent. 1000% dependent on whether Sim's streaming or not, and I haven't heard a damn word from him about it, so. Uh, maybe. <laughs> the plan is stream until either Landy or Sim start, whoever starts first. 
Marwell is British? Yes. All but one of Oxy's maps have been British, and the only one that wasn't was Irish. You're trying to get it on console. You should. Put the determination in, Nathan. You can do it. I believe in you. Um, it says you can't perform this action. Do you own the BGA, Bradley? Because you need to own the BGA. Hey, Dusty. I almost forgot you got Dusty Cove coming as well. Eventually. When Dusty can bother actually opening G. Um... <laughs> So I'm not just bringing the corn header off for a, 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 a jolly old jaunt across the map here. I am actually going to a field that is owned and hopefully is planted in corn because I've not bothered checking. That's a silly idea. BJ's bottle seven and eight. Uh, uh, oh god. <laughs> oh god. Are you sure the BJ is? Oh, oh yeah, it is. Huh. I don't know then. You're in a forest, uh, not in Dusty Cove. Slacking in a new way. Very impressive, Dusty. <laughs> what will I have? Logitech G27 with a big old dent in it after, uh, after Friday. Those of you that were here Friday know exactly why there's a big old dent in my G27. Big old dent that conveniently fits my knuckle in it quite nicely. I wonder why that could be there. It sucks you have to own the BJ if you want to have two farms doing sides, they can't do it. That's kind of the point, I think. Hey, doggish. Not your usual area for your map. Ooh. This corn isn't fully grown yet, is it? Corn that's over here. Oh, what's in field 7? Oh, that's fields. That's not fully. That's field 9, and it's fully grown, but... No, that's field 10. That's not... Oh, crap on a cracker. Right, you can come into this yardy kind of area here and just sit down, because there's nothing for you to do here. There was a fly on... Yeah, there was a big fly on the wheel that angered me to the point where I punched the wheel. Um... So you're continuing to go, that's good. You're also... I'm... actually kind of surprised. Um, so let's get the vent going on... Uh, I think there's a cultivator around here. Well, we can get the fence seeding. Do I want to get the fence seeding? No, because something's going to cultivate over it. Oh, no. Or plow over it. Right. What are the states of the fields that I do own? Uh, so 16 is reseeded, 15 is being cultivated, 17 is being, well, 15 is being cultivated, 17 is being cultivated, or plowed up, just bog standard. Um, 16 could do with some fertilizer, now that would be a job for our 1050 here. You have to retexture files to get an amount of, probably worthwhile though. Um, where did I put the sprayer? Because I know I've got a sprayer, just can't... There it is. Watching Shy's videos. Yeah, I think everybody watches Shy's videos to try and grasp what the hell's going on with modding at this point. BJ of opening times? It might. He's animated the horse walker. I've not looked at anything Shy's done uh, for 19. I don't plan on doing many edits for 19, so I'm not really checking them out. Some Bill Bill's post. I've not looked at it, but I can imagine what he said. Um. You have a school concert in like 20 minutes and you're scared. Why are you scared? Alright, mods, but you can't be bothered. You'd actually make them for console. 
You'd be better off starting off just for PC, frankly. Um, that's not me saying PC is better. It's easier to make. It's just easier to make mods for PC. Right. Which one of these is the fertilizer? The fertilizer is the white ones, I think. I think these are fertilizer. Yeah. The black one's herbicide by... My process of elimination, these have to be the liquid fertilizer. Your console player, you want to use the mods that you make. Bear in mind, console mods are the absolute hardest to make. There's a reason that many mod mods make it a console, and very few people start off trying to make console mods. Um, that's not a slight on console players, it's, it's literally like console mods, or that's not even a slight on modders. Console mods are just objectively difficult to do, because they've got to be pretty much perfect. Like, if you're making a mod for console, you've got to basically make a perfect mod. Probably make it a little bit more... no. I think a lot of the PC players do understand exactly how hard it is for a mod to get on console. So if something gets on console, there's a kind of a bit more applause for it. At least I'd hope so. People who understand how modding works will applaud uh, console mods that's a small bit more. I love all wheel steer. Console players must be very impatient. Console players in general are. They come across as impatient, but I... I, I <laughs> considering how difficult it is for modders to get stuff on console, I'd say they're actually quite patient. Um, and some just give a bad impression. Okay, that's this full. It's over to field 16 we go, which is accessible in the other direction. Well, this way. You have to create a whole new model for console? You don't necessarily have to, but if your model's not great, then yeah, you will. Is this map meant to come to console? No. This one's staying PC only. The Blender just went, nope. <laughs> yeah, that's how most people start and finish mod uh, modeling. Or making models of like. Okay, I'm gonna make a model. Let's open blend. No, 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 no. Because Blender is the most terrifying program known to man to open up for the first time. There's a cube and literally no help. You play on console, you're very patient. You're only too glad to have. Mods are all on, yeah. Thing is, you got people now who started playing in 17 and are used to mods on consoles, so they forget that bit. But don't know how to change the spring sensitivity of the logic menu for the wheel, so there's like mine on FS19. Yours is hard to change. Um, I know how to do it on G27 only, and I know most people now have G29s or G920s, so I can't help you there. VF, I think, did a video on it. Um, based on the information I gave him, uh, he made a video on how to do it, which I could have done, but again, I don't have the the right wheel to be able to do it. Like I don't, we don't only be able to help people with older wheels, because uh, as far as I'm aware, they've actually changed what the options are called and where they're located for the 920 and G29. The most fun thing to do, the most common thing is, 
people figure out how to delete the cube, and then they're faced with just a blank screen. So some people, their their entire experience in Blender is, I could delete a cube, then I, uh, <laughs> Does anybody know if Sim's gonna stream today? By the way, Mr. Simulate, is he gonna be streaming today? Yeah, Thrustmaster sent to, uh, I think, have centering on by default because they're belt driven. So all you could do? All you could do is delete the cube. Thing is, if I put enough time in, I could definitely make a model in Blender, but it'd take hours. Um, and if I was to get into doing mods again, uh, I'd probably make sheds, because they're in the grand scheme of things, the easiest things to make. I'd probably make like sheds, prefabs and placeables. Couldn't even delete the cube. Uh, GD, select the cube and press delete. <laughs> hey, Charlie. Yeah, sheds and stuff are just like a bunch of cubes. Half of a cylinder. There you go, you've got a shed. Well done, sir. Uh, if I was to make a mod with a on console... If I was making prefabs only, no, because prefabs can only be used in GE. If I made a placeable, then probably. You change the colour of the cube and then deleted it. Texturing is the worst thing to try and do in Blender. I It confuses the crap out of me. Do I know more mods will come on the mod hub? No, but I'm presuming tomorrow. That'll be my guess, Kevin. So, from what it seems like what's been happening in the last couple of weeks, um, an educated guest says there'll be more mods on the mod hub tomorrow, with it being Tuesday. And after tomorrow, then the next bunch, after Tuesday's bunch, will be on Thursday. It seems like they're... Um, putting mods live twice a week at the moment on Tuesdays and Thursdays so I wouldn't necessarily expect some tomorrow but don't be surprised if there are some tomorrow and then don't be surprised if there are some on Thursday see you Alexander enjoy whatever it is, whatever it is you gotta go do um, I'm gonna shoot some a message and be like yo dude you streaming today so I kind of need to figure out... Ooh, I've been offered a game. Let's have a look at that after the stream. Um, No, I don't want to say at. There we go. I've wasted quite a lot of fertilizer there and I'm aware of it. Do me and Lanny and Sim know each other personally? Lanny and Sim met up in real life. I've not met either of them in real life, but we speak most nights, so... yes? In fact, I just shot Sim a message on... well, shot everybody a message on Facebook. Do I drive? If so, what kind of... I don't drive. Have I met Chris? No, actually. I've not mess met anyone from YouTube. I've just got word, by the way, that Simulate is planning on streaming. Must be a pain. Yeah, it's a pain not being able to drive, but sure. What else can you do? It's a pain not being able to walk. <laughs> Uh, 
I, I don't know, Yanis. I, I guess it's because it's easier to just come into a stream that you're already in and say, hey, are there new mods? Instead of just going to, like, farming-simulator.com forward slash mods. You can still drive if you can't walk. Yeah, but it's much healthier to walk, so... It's part of the reason I want to start getting up early is so that I can go for a walk around the block once a day. And eventually, hopefully, like, progress to doing a few miles on a weekend. Because um, there's this one place in town that I really love going and it's several miles of a walk, but it's really nice to get to. Someone just said there was... I think that was intended as a joke. Um... Sign my bike to power PC. That's something else I've been considering, because the bike needs new inner... Well, the bike needs new tires in general. And, uh, I'm kind of half considering getting that renovated and revamped and, and going for a cycle, but... I, I don't know, I feel like a walk would be more logical, because I don't have to worry about my legs being vandalized. Because <laughs> I've had the bike vandalized in the past. You have to get food. See a farm life. I think what I'm going to do next... I'm just going to set off the soybeans that we've got in storage. Just to get a bit more money. Yeah, walking will be a lot... Well... Believe it or not, GD, cycling would be easier, especially seeing as there's one way that I can leave the house that if I cycle, I don't really need to pedal at all for about half a mile. Because um, I live on the side of a mountain, and one of the roads away from my house is uh, pretty much a mountain road, so I just roll down it. That's how I used to get downtown. Was just go down that road, just like cycle to the end of the road, and then just freewheel. Whee! Break for the speed bumps. Gotta pedal back. Yeah, that's when I take the less steep road. It's actually my plan for walking is, is taking that route. Going down the steep road and coming back the less steep road. You drive to the shop around the corner. That I would walk to. Helper H is blocked by an object. Shouldn't be. Was the object me by any chance? Off to make some money with the soybeans. Come on, Martha, we're off to the shops. We're selling the soybeans today, Martha. Five grand insurance, you're driving no matter what. That's fair enough. <laughs> hey, VF. You don't played 19s much you have 17. That's not too surprising. There's not many mods out for 19 yet, and there's a lot of people. I'm guessing yourself included, included Bananagram. But just don't enjoy the game without mods. Or don't enjoy the game as much without mods. Hey Commander after hours, what's up? Not a whole lot. Just chill. Um We'll be ending the stream very, very shortly, by the way. Should mention this. I will be finishing up in the next probably five to ten minutes. Um, not out of laziness, but because Mr. Simulator is going live, and uh, it's it's his stream day too. <laughs> I can't be bothered going back to seventeen, honestly. Like I I actually kind of like playing nineteen vanilla. Um, I'm missing a few scripts, sure, but. I can make do with Command Console to replace a lot of them. Um, so it's, uh, it's kind of fine otherwise. Hey, Arn Agri. How you doing today, dude? If you're enjoying the stream, this is going to be the only call for this, actually. Yeah. 
I was gonna say, this is the last call, it's the only call that I made. If you're enjoying the stream, do hit the subscribe button, and also hit the like button. And, uh, if this was a two hour stream, I'd say sure too, but there's no point in cheering when you can subscribe and like. Not yet, yeah, 19's kinda had a stumbly start, but it does seem to be, uh, does seem to be rolling forward a bit now, which is nice. I think people were just frustrated with the Giants maps again, which is the traditional frustration with the Giants maps, but I've never seen it quite this bad. The F6 spawn, a lot of mods aren't showing up even though on the map for Xbox. You might be looking through, like, the wrong category, because I always have that problem, Ethan, that I'm looking through, like, the wrong category on the in-game mod hub for something. Because some of the stuff is, like, categorized really weird, or was in 17. It seems like they've expanded the categories for 19, so it's a bit easier to find stuff. I think when Marvel comes out, it'll really start hitting its stride, Ernie. KSP. I've not played KSP in quite a while. Click on show all mods, or... Like, if, if something can fit into three different categories, check all three. PC version is close to turning a corner. Um, console version is... Like, Giant's progress on mod is slow because there's a lot of mods and I... I'm thinking a lot of them are not very high quality, unfortunately. So they're being tested and taking up time and being failed because they're not very high quality. I think there's a lot of... In-game equipment, but you can change the color of it mods, which... They get rejected kind of almost automatically. Um, that are taking up a lot of the, the test team's time and uh, causing kind of the delay for for, for mods coming out um, and mods getting tested as well. It'd be nice if people stopped <laughs> submitting those mods because then testing would be faster and there would be more mods out in the mod hub, but... You know, you ain't gonna be able to tell people what to do. You ain't gonna be able to tell people, okay, just don't make this kind of mod anymore. When this, do you mean when I save mid February from Marwell? Because that's a guess. <laughs> Myself and Landy are saying mid February just at a guess based on the number of mods in testing, and past experiences with Giants in the mod hub. Um, is it worth buying 17 if you have 19? No. 19's kind of had a slow start, it's starting to hit its stride now, mods are going to start coming out a bit. 17 just for mods. A lot of the mods are going to come forward to 19. But when we say mid-February, likely for Meadowgrove, it's not, you know, information from Giants. It's not official information. It's us taking an educated guess based on knowing... ...kind of what the mod hub timelines are like. Not necessarily knowing the entire process, but knowing what the timelines are like. Um, like, it's already failed once. There's probably another failure yet to come for Meadowgrove, or for... Not for Meadowgrove, from Barrowell. They fed from it grow to be uploaded or to be released? Because if it's not uploaded yet, then I would say you're pushing into March. Um, for Marwell, it's, it's going to be kind of mid to late February, I think. Landy sad boy sometimes. I can be a sad boy sometimes, but that's just the way that I am. And Marwell, yeah, mid feb for Marwell, I would say Meadow Grove would be pushing into March. Mid late feb for being uploaded, ah, then yeah, you're definitely pushing into March, maybe early April, depending on what the test numbers are like by then. Can't wait for the Browns to come out. Neither can I, and they've been uploaded for a while, and I think Giants are using a system of um, 
people what caused the least trouble getting tested first for 19. But unfortunately, CD um, did have a habit uh, in 17 of causing a bit of trouble with Giants, so he might be uh, might be a bit down that list. I think, Dusty, here's what me and Landy think happened. Giants are looking through the list daily and picking out stuff that would... Yeah, <laughs> classic CD, I guess. Yeah. I'm saying nothing. <laughs> Uh, I think Giants are looking through the list daily and finding stuff that people would like. Uh, which doesn't explain Thursday's just wait... I, I don't understand what happened Thursday with the 17 different waits that released. We don't need that many! <laughs> um, but I think they're looking through for like mods that people would like and maps. Uh, which is possibly how Ma uh, Marwell got tested so quickly. Because it was it was seemingly pushed very quickly through to test to testing, um, so I, th I think giants are trying to get ma maps out. Weights are quick and easy to test. Yes, but we don't need seventy three different weights releasing on the same day. <laughs> it would have been nice to see like a tractor for the weights. <laughs> I just here have all of the weights in the world. Well, thanks, but that's. Can I make a tractor out of these? <laughs> Let me know when Sims Live, by the way, guys. Um, how did they list the mods and the maps? I don't... I should have asked. That would have been a cool thing to know. Um, 7810. 7810's been lovely. I want a 7810. Um, from what... I've, from what I know, they bring it through GE at the very least. I think they bring it through the Giants dev kit as well. Um, well, Dusty, those the, the converts from 17 don't necessarily need testing. They're made by a different team, so that's kind of fine. They're Q, they are QA tested, but they're not as thoroughly QA tested as external mods. They do have to run everything for console through the dev kit. I know that much because that's how they get the console errors. Um, which there's no way to see them on PC, so modders upload blindly for console testing, which sucks. And there really needs to be a way to check for those errors on PC. Whether it's in Giants Editor or like a third program that you'd have to use or another program. Uh, VF, no. <laughs> I know for a fact, no, they did not. <laughs> From uh, conversations I had, <laughs> they were not ready. <laughs> Most of them were not ready. But that was the dev team working on those. That wasn't the, uh, the QA team. Based on uh, specific stuff they said when I was out there? The only one that was vaguely ready, other than the few that released on day one, was the Big Bud, and that didn't have a mod desk. <laughs> Elper H, that's the one over here. You're not finished, good sir. So, based on what I heard, yeah, there was nothing actually ready, um, other than like three or four four of the smaller and easier mods big bud was had no mod desk as i said so that 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 <laughs> no mod desk means no mod sims live sims live thank you so we'll finish up the stream here head on over to mr simulate which you're probably going to do anyway uh julian asks him to do it he is on sudden farm as well so head on over there, he'll give you internet cookies, and make sure to tell him he smells. Make sure to annoy the absolute crap out of him on my behalf. Um, I'll be over there as well, but though I'll likely be working on stuff on Spud Pewter. Because um, I started on something and I need I want to get it worked on. Uh, but I need to get more done on it, so I'm probably going to work on that while he's streaming. Until tomorrow, stay safe, and goodbye.